Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, I'm Jess. I'm gonna be doing a prom look this week. I did have an inspiration from this girl right here on Instagram. I don't know well, if I did see. my brows and base off of camera, um, and we're just gonna go straight into the eyes. So today we're gonna be using the Makeup Forever Professional Paris Artist Shadows One Palette and the Benefit World Famous Neutrals Palette. All right guys, so I just finished one eye and I'm gonna show you how to do it on the other eye. We're gonna go in with the Forever Makeup Forever Professional Paris um, Shadows One. And we're gonna start off with this gray shade in the palette. You're gonna focus that on the crease, so. Now with that same brush, we're going to go in with the shade underneath, which is just the black in the palette, and build that color up also. So we're going to focus this one on the out, outer corner of the lid, and then blend that in with the gray and the crease. So, so drag it in. This one, we're not dragging it all the way in, we're just dragging it halfway. Alright, so once those two colors seem seamless, I'm going to be taking some concealer and putting that on the back of my hand to cut the crease. So as always, to cut my crease, I'm going to be using a Morphe E43 brush. And I'm only cutting it halfway to where we um, started putting the black, that's where you're going to stop. So, Oh, also, we're not starting it right here, we're starting it a little bit higher. Because we are dragging that silver down to the bottom waterline, so... I'm going in with this flat brush and I'm going to be taking the Benefit World Famous Neutrals palette. Once you open it, it looks like this. We're going to be taking this silver shade right here. It's called um, Blingo and you're going to pack that on top of the concealer. So. With that same brush, just drag it down to the bottom water, to halfway of the bottom water line. Then going back in with the Morphe M433 brush, we're going to go into that black shade we used earlier and just deepen up the outer corner. Alright, so next I'm going to be going in with liquid liner and I'm going to be using the Estee Lauder Little Black Liner. Um, the cool thing about this liner is that it does have a thick side and it's kind of like, I don't know if y'all can see it, it's like flat and then it gets skinny on one side. And then on the other side it has a pointy one. Just make the black line with the thick side and then you switch it and make the wing with the the ultra fine section or sorry the ultra fine side. Taking the Morphe uh, E43 brush and some concealer and cleaning that up so your um, eyeshadow gets cleaned up and so your wing is sharp. So. so 
So once you're done with that, we're just going to take a little brush and go in with the black and just blend that out, smoke that out on the bottom waterline. Alright, so to finish off the eyes, I'm going to be taking a black eyeliner and just putting it in my waterline. So. And then I'm going to be taking the IT Cosmetics Superhero Mascara and adding a coat to the bottom and top lashes. Alright guys, so once I'm done with the eyes, I can move on to the face. I don't know what this was, but anyway, we can move on to the face. I'm going to be going in with the Hula Bronzer and a Real Techniques Multi-Task um, Brush and bronzing up the face with this. And to really make that um, contour pop, we're going to be taking the Airspun Loose Face Powder on a damp beauty blender. Now for highlight, you already know, I'm going to be going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit in that glow. Um, I'm going to be taking the shade Sunburst, but before I do that, I'm going to spray half of my face and put highlight on that half and then on the other half. Alright guys, so for the lips, I'm going to be taking this Milani Lip Liner. It just says 04, so I'm assuming that's like the style of it. And I'm just going to be filling in my entire lips with this color. If you're comfortable with leaving it just like that with the lip liner, that's totally okay. It's going to last you a while. Um, but I'm going to be going over it with the color um, Jolt by Maybelline. I just found this um, and this is in the shade Stripped Down 05. So this is the final look. If you do end up using this look for prom, um, definitely tag me on my social medias, which are, which are going to be um, somewhere right here. But yeah, um, let me know if you liked it. If you want to see more prom videos, I do realize I did use um, silver, and some people are going to be using gold. Um, so if you want to see a gold or a browns um, prom look, then definitely let me know in the comments below. Um, but yeah, you're welcome to put your own twist on it, and I'll see you guys in my next video.